Muranga County and we meet Mrs. Beth Muraya at her farm in Kandundu village tending to her biogas plant. Since she switched to biogas from firewood three years ago, she has never looked back. I went to a certain place and saw a colleague using biogas and decided to embark on production since I had a cow and a garden. To embark on production, one must have at least three cows. The dung is collected and mixed with water to remove unsuitable matter, then stirred. The thick paste is passed through a tunnel into a deep pit next to the cow shed. The sludge is then compressed to fermentation until it emits the biogas that is later sent through green pipes channeled towards the residential house for cooking and lighting. The project cost her 120,000 shillings, approximately $1,400, but she has discovered that firewood is more costly in the long run. Uh, since then, I have never bought gas again. When it becomes less, I simply prepare more dung to add. I also use the dung as manure. Biogas is principally a mixture of methane and carbon dioxide along with other trace gases. Biogas is eco-friendly as it is made of biodegradable material. Firewood on the other hand leads to depletion of forests. The current levels of dangerous gases in the atmosphere is rising because of human factors and at the Cape Point station monitoring of carbon dioxide, methane and carbon monoxide takes place. The Global Atmospheric Watch Station here at Cape Point is the biggest in South Africa and is built partly on a rock with air inlet and several pieces of meteorological equipment mounted on a platform and exposed to the sea on top of a cliff. The other stations in Africa are located in Mount Kenya and Algeria, their locations based on height. Uh, that is one of the reasons these stations are placed in, in, a, in a global network is because country emissions are not located just within that country and each country can affect their neighboring and also far more distant countries from them. So it's important to have a global coverage of total emissions to the atmosphere. In the control tower, all atmospheric gases measured are relayed through transmission gadgets.